Hey everyone, my name is Evie and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be playing Calico, a game in which you own a cat cafe. Now I love cats, so this sounds like an absolute dream to me, so I'm super excited to dive into it and surround myself with all the cats I could ever want. Let's go! Oh, that seems to be our cafe! Calico! Hey! Alright, let's see. There's us, looking very basic. Oh my gosh! Ah, uh, hello! Welcome to Heart Village. I'm Kiva, the mayor of this little village. We are so excited to have you here, and we are all so sad to have your aunt retire and the cafe shut down. Honestly, the village just isn't the same without her. Though she did send me a postcard last week, and it looks like she's really enjoying traveling. Apparently, there are cats on other islands. Isn't that amazing? I mean, yeah. Seems logical. Oh, whoops! Of course you'd know all that about that, having come from another island. Anywho, all that matters is that you are here now. First things first, why don't you look inside your new cafe? It's a little boring and empty right now, but it's up to you to fix. Why don't you go inside and check the place out? Come back and talk to me when you're done. Oh jeez, wait! Even more first, I need to give you your welcome gift. Here is a couple things that will help you settle in. Ooh. All right, let's go inside. Okay. And then this is our place. Oh, that's cute. I like it. Oh, and the little... Oh, the skylights are gorgeous. All right. Oh, cat, cat. Hold the pet. Oh, wait, wrong one. Oh my gosh! Hold to wiggle animal. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Woo! <laughs> okay, let's let's put it down. Um no, I don't want to store the animal. Um Hey friendo, did you check out the place? I love the layout and the starship skylight is so pretty, yes. There's a lot of work to do though, it's completely empty of both people, animals and food. Actually I bought you some furniture to help out, but I embarrassingly didn't know which cat you would like best so I ended up bringing a whole bunch. What would you say your style is? Cute spooky red. Cute! Oh perfect, I have these items of that type, you should place them in a the cafe when you get time. Okay, but how do I put the animal down? Oh, like that, okay. So... Inventory. Cute. Okay. So let's place this one there. Alright. Oh, yay! Be sitting. Can I stand again? Hmm, okay, what's next? Animals! Your aunt always had a bunch of cute cuddly animals in the cafe. Honestly, it's the best part of the whole thing. Why don't you look around and adopt an animal for the cafe? Normally you should avoid wild animals, but the magic of this island has made them all super friendly and cuddly. You can pick up any animal and use the command to tell them to follow you or go to the cafe. Your animal journal gives track of all the animals you've met and lets you give them names, summon them to your party, and or give them hats! <gasps> hats! Alright, so... Animals. Okay. So... Where's Calico? Hi Calico! Pick up Calico. No. See now mine? Yes. Okay. Let's go find some more. Oh, I see one. Kitty, 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 come here. Is it a doggo? It's a doggo. Hello. Aussie! 
go to the cafe. Do you know what's on mine? Yay! Okay. Oh, what's this place? Hello! Can I say hi to you? Hi! Hello there, my name is Ma Maya, Vice President of the Owl Club at your service. Oh, but I'm sorry, I'm the Vice President of nothing right now. There was a landslide that blocked the path into the mountains. If we can't go to the mountains, that means we can't go to the Owl Club headquarters. And if we can't go to the Owl Club headquarters, that means we can't, you can't meet Freya. She's the president of the Owl Club and the president of my heart. No, I'm a real, in a real pickle of beans right now, is what I'm saying. Oh, okay, that sucks. We'll get back to you. I want some more animals. Oh, hi. Char. Hi, go to the cafe. Who are you? Hello, meow, meow, mew, meow, 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 mew. Just say hi, mew. Okay. Hey, always cool to see a fresh face around here. I'm Ash. I um, work at the general store. I guess I'm Estelle's assistant. I don't always get her, but I've learned more magic from her than I ever did in magic school. So this job isn't the worst. All right. Ooh, I see a kitty cat. But let's talk to these people. Hello. You there. You look like a person that appreciates a good flower. And we appreciate people that appreciate good flowers. But good flowers is what we got. Uh, I don't get to practice my sales pitch to new people very often, but you get the idea. I'm Lily. I help my boss run the flower store. Alright, so that's her dad. Well, look who it is. It's been so long since I've seen you. Why, you've grown up from a sprout to a sunflower. Yeah. We've never met before, have we? Oh, thank goodness. I thought I just had forgotten. My name's... The name's Poppy. I run the flower shop along with my daughter Lily. You can never have too many flowers. Okay. But I want cats. You can never have too many cats. Hi! Chumpy! Go to the cafe! Hello again! Was What was the last thing? I can't seem to recall! Oh! Food! Duh! Okay, so the other thing you need to learn is making food for the cafe. Can't have a cafe without cafe food and drinks! Your aunt left a couple recipes, but it's not many. I'm sure if you talk to other villagers, they may be able to share some family recipes with you in exchange for your help. But for now, why don't you dive, head into the kitchen and try out one of those recipes? Sounds good! Oh, something else to note is this island is very much based on in old magic. The way we do things is a bit different here. I think you'll really enjoy the cooking though. It's pretty fun to throw an egg the size of your whole body. Excuse me? Sorry, what? Oh, you'll see. Go try it out. Okay. Make food. Cupcake. Okay! That's kind of fun. <laughs> oh, that's too far. Come back! Oh, no! Better come back! No, 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 no. Don't, don't. Good job. Come back, come back, come back, come back. Why are you so slidey? Thank you. No, I want the egg. Well, that was easy. Ah, I'm so proud of you. You're a natural. I guess all that's left is meeting some of your neighbors. Once you've met someone, they will start coming to the cafe whenever they have free time in their schedule. When people visit your cafe, they will the food you've made, even when you aren't there. Your magical food stock is infinite, so don't worry about making new food every day. However, the town folk all have different tastes, so if you can change up the food in your display case, they may tip you more for their favorites. Unfortunately, we had some problems traveling to and from the other areas of the island, which sucks. I haven't been able to get to the hot springs for months. Maybe one of the villagers has an idea how to fix some of the blockades. Anyway, I hope you get the cafe back up and running. If you ever want to chat with me about it, you can find me or anyone else 
You met on your map. See ya, friendo! Alright. Well, we already learned about the mountain path. I guess we go again. That's an awesome house, though. Hello! Hello there! Yeah, we already... yes. Oh no, what's wrong? Uh, I don't know if Kiha mentioned this to you, but there is a landslide at the entrance of Snowball Mountain. It's such a bummer. Can I help? Oh my gosh, that would be amazing. I have no idea how you can help, but if you can find a way through, I promise you can be a prestigious member of our Owl Club. I've asked anyone in, everyone in town to help, but no one except for Autumn. I haven't asked her yet. She lives in the bottle on top of the hill next to your cafe. It's really high and I'm scared of heights. I know that seems weird for an owl-based magic girl, but I actually can't fly. Okay. Find Autumn. Wait, where did she live? Alright, there. So... Can we adopt the... Crow? Hello! Go to the cafe! Up we go! This is very steep! I'm impressed that she can walk up this mountain so fast. The heck? Hello! Oh, this is pretty! Hello! Hi, Autumn. Greetings, traveler, and welcome to my palatial emporium of potent, potable, portable, pourable potions. That's a mouthful. I'm Potum. The Autumn. I'm Autumn. S sorry, I don't have any potions available right now. My cat Char is missing, and I have no idea where she is, and the word has gotten me totally behind on making potions. Lost cat. Whoa, that would be incredible. I have the feeling she might be near the center of town. Last time she went missing, I found her in a pile of clothing at the clothing store. She wasn't there when I checked earlier, but it's probably a good place to start. Didn't I char? Yes. Party. Can she... Does she come here when I say that? Oh, yeah, there she is. Is this your char? Yay, we found them! I can't believe you found my char so quickly. How can I ever repay you? Help with the landslide? Hmm, that's a hard one. It would be great to be able to go back to the mountains since one of my biggest customers is there. Lumi up at the Snowbell Hot Springs always commissions potions for me to her herbal bath. I don't really make potions that blow up rocks though. Let me think about this a bit. I got it! Come back tomorrow and I should have something ready for you. Okay. Well. Let's go to sleep then. Is that a cat butt? Okay. What the hell? Sure. Ooh. I want to do some more cooking. Coffee and a cupcake. Sounds perfect to me. And then let's make a macaron as well. I'm just vibing to the music here. Oh, no! No! Damn it. I swear I can actually throw stuff.
flour. Sugar. Alright, let's go to bed. Hi, Doggo! Aww. Doggo, Doggo, cute! Alright, bedtime. Save and sleep. And I think with that, we'll leave this part here. This is an adorable looking game and I can definitely see myself playing more of this. So keep your eye out for more videos of Kralika on this channel. For now though, I want to wish you a wonderful day and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye bye!